All right. So hopefully I got all the technical difficulties handled. Like for some reason, yeah. Google Hangouts was not detecting my voice, people. So that's why the reason why we're a little bit late. And not only are we a little bit late, but I actually have to end the stream early. Uh, no, it has nothing to do with Boxing Day. I'm not British, so we're not doing that. I, I can't believe Sandy actually asked me that. <laughs> like, are you not streaming for Boxing Day? Like, I'm not British. The only Boxing Day we're going to have is if I'm going to go over there and punch you in the face, because no. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's like a, a really big British thing, I guess. But uh, yeah, uh, I have to go and take Rennie to a job interview, so I'm going to have to end the stream early. So we're only going to stream for an hour, but... Uh, Omega will, of course, be back next uh, weekend if they choose to uh, come back. And we'll do our usual two hours. So, you know, I start, I don't feel bad because, uh, you know, we did we did uh, three hours last weekend. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know what deck I want to use. I guess I could try Supervise again, even though it has not been working out lately. I think I got, like, one yeah, deck to Supervise. That's too inconsistent. It really is. It really is. I went back and worked on Monarchs, and I was like, man, there's no Monarchs I'm going to run with Dark Monster. I can run. It's like, so like a Monarch. Uh, man, each thing. I completely forgot about this guy. So I could just lock this guy out. It's just that, tw that uh, 1,200 booty sucks because, yeah, it's always 1,000 defense, not 1,200. But it's fine. So he's kind of like a pseudo Monarch, which just works. So I got to run this to have the consistency of getting my cards. Like, I'm going to get this. So, I mean, I guess I can try Monarchs, but I still don't think this will work on paper. On paper, it just doesn't seem like it'll work. Uh, I haven't played Cosmic Cube Bell in a while. We can, we can try Cosmic Cube Bell. Yeah, although it is just you Bell thrown in a, in a young sync deck. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck it. We'll go with this. You yeah, actually know what? Uh, I don't know if anybody wants on the stream wants to duel me because. I don't want to spend the stream dueling randoms. Like I said, it's going to be a shorter stream because i super busy. Sure. <laughs> the true king. <laughs> so if anybody wants to duel me, message me on DN, and then I'll go ahead and duel you guys priority before just doing random duels. Is there anything that you want to do on the stream, Omega? Mm, not sure, probably. Since it's so short, probably not. Hot girls only. <laughs> there are any curves on the end right now. <laughs> How many people are on? Like 2,000 plus? Yeah, none of these are hot girls. <laughs> Alright, it's great. I'll just do a random duel because I don't want to sit here doing nothing. Yep. I, said, I, I, really, I really regret doing this, but I don't have a choice. I'm reluctant to take Rennie, but I have to. Because I always got to do things that people want me to do, even though I don't want to do them, and it sucks. Yeah, I'll go first. <sighs> me too. But, uh, creations. Eh, this hand's not bad. Mm. Yeah, definitely not terrible. The question is, how do I want to take it? Do I want to get the Armageddon Knight, send the U-Bell, and take it slow, or do I want to set the cheat one? I have the creation, so I can double float. I can pull off the yeah. Uh, yeah, I think just use the Armageddon Knight and then set the creation. Yeah. I think that's probably the best idea. What's up, Jordan? And, uh, Mal. <laughs> We'll get Armageddon Knight, drop you Bell, and set the creation. Hopefully shit doesn't hit the fan, because this all this reveals is I'm playing you Bell, but it doesn't reveal what you Bell deck I'm playing, so that's fine. I'll go ahead and bait with the Dark Hole, because I really don't want him to destroy the creation. You can have the Dark Hole if you want it. No my luck, he'll probably just twin twister me. Yeah, possibly. <laughs> if they play before such your cards. I would not be surprised. Ah oh, no, he's just gonna throw the MST at me. Wow, and he actually got my fucking creation too. Yeah, probably them staying for the win. <laughs> I tried to hide it, but he's like, nah, let me just go ahead and MST you. I'm like, oh, alright. No, it's scare girls. Oh, okay. He's the attacker. Really, I haven't seen much of this guy. I know he's in the structure deck, but. 
no one really plays him. It's kind of slow. Yeah, he's just way too slow. And it only has 100 defense as well, like, why? Hmm. We What's should it have mean? a knight in 100 defense instead, like Kiar Garmor. <laughs> They're There's just like, no, no give him the attack. Uh, once per turn, you can change this card to face on defense position. This card is slipped up. You can destroy any number of spells or trap on the field up to number of gear gear, other gear gear monsters you control. Hmm. Debating on what I want to do. Because I have a feeling that he's going to be able to pop my uh, my dark hole next turn. So I'm thinking about maybe just summoning Chi Wen, playing the dark hole, and then summoning Suwani and going after him with Suwani. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and dark hole you. It's, I know you're just gonna pop it next turn anyway. Whether it just be summoning another one, uh, flip it, flip it down, flip back up. Oh, thank you. So it's Swanee. Then Swanee, it's a nice 19 beater. It's yeah, like but didn't care. <laughs> like, of course. Yeah, call the advantage wise, you are losing pretty much. Yep. Sucks that he just he hella sniped out my freaking uh my creations. Damn it! Tried yeah, to bait him. <laughs> Much rather you took my freaking dark hole. All right. So I saw No, it here. doesn't work that way. Yeah. Um, this card is special. In fact, you could special when you know, no, no. When this card is <laughs> special by the effect of a gear gear monster, you can special summon a gear gear monster from your hand. Yeah, doing it wrong. yeah, you're doing it wrong. How was that special summoned? <laughs> you just normal summoned it and just got it. Oh, okay, and then quit. No, <laughs> of course. Yeah. Complete of course. scrub. Scrub, good job. You don't even read your own cards. First fucking sentence, fuck it up. Unless I really gave a shit about TM Tempo, but still. Oop. That, that, that was lame. Well, that's the end for you. Mm -hmm. Especially on rated. <laughs> I, I feel bad that the stream has to be short, and it's not even my fault either. If it was up to me, it would just be the full stream, but nope. It's just inconvenienced the hell out of me. So, anyway, how was your Christmas? If you saw mm -hmm. your Christmas. It was kind of okay, like. We don't really celebrate it much. Is it because you just don't celebrate it because of your religion, or just you just didn't celebrate it? Um, yeah, we just don't celebrate it much. Like, of course, we are not Christians or anything. <laughs> well, of course, Christmas is not even a Christian holiday. It's actually mm -hmm. pagan. It's like the same exact hand. Yeah. Yeah, it was okay. It's, it's, it's just kind of a meh day. I didn't really do much either. Just drawing this ultimate nightmare. <laughs> At least I got the limit reverse, so... I guess I'll get Dark Reffer instead. At least 17 beater instead. And I can pitch ultimate nightmare, because I really don't need ultimate nightmare in my hand. Yeah, completely useless in hand, of course. You get any presents? No. <laughs> so it's just a normal day. Yeah, almost, yeah. So we agreed on no presents, but... Yeah. We agreed on no presents, but Mom decided to get everybody a present because... Yeah. <laughs> so she's, like, she's like, oh, I want flowers for Christmas. <laughs> so me and Rennie... She took the car. So me and Rennie had to walk down to the store. And of course, Christmas, everything was closed. It was just a huge inconvenience, to say the least. Like, Smith's, Walmart... Everything, everything was closed. Except for Walgreens. Yeah, like the whole day. The whole day. It's like I oh my god. It's like I was like, wow, did everybody forget what today is? No, not Christmas. Friday. <laughs> so we had to get her some we got her some chocolate covered cherries because we couldn't even go to Walmart to get her some flowers. It was just really inconvenient. Every restaurant was closed. We were hungry, so I think we went to 7-Eleven and got food from 7-Eleven, which wasn't closed. And everything that was open was super crowded. Everything. Wow. Yes, it is. 
DVDs and you're going to foolish uh, Copernicus. I don't see that often. Isn't Copernicus this, usually doing the one sending stuff? Oh, you just got to send it back with night. Ni I guess that's why. To make a synchro play. <laughs> DVDs are actually pretty good in Doshi Chit. They are topping quite a lot. Mm -hmm. Very aggressive deck that can slope pretty hard. I've noticed this. Yep. They just have a hard time against the boardy figures. Mm -hmm. They can go in, but if you summon something that's like stronger, that that's like three thousand, then unless they can pull off that uh, fusion of the the king, they just have a hard time. Um, or make that rank eight. Of course, of course. It probably has something to do with freaking Omega being here, because whenever Omega's involved, they like to tweet out a different language. <laughs> oh my god, it's so probably in the stone. Of... <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like, of course, of course I speak another language. Yeah, of course. I guess last time it was Finnish or something. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, Going to what, Alexander? No, actually, it's not Estonian, it's something else. Really? Yeah. Like I said, Google, Google Hangouts has just been ass. I'm gonna get, uh, hopefully, I get fucking uh, uh, OBS working soon. Another DD monster is no more special summon, you can target this. You can yeah, that target might be better if you have a good computer. My computer is decent. Getting old. No, that's not Arabic. It's uh, I don't know if, if it's Spanish or Portuguese. It's hard to tell, brother. Mm, I really thought he was going to go more in. He pulled out Alexander, he sent the slime. I thought maybe you're going to go like banish slime, summon from your hand, and that was going to summon you back at night howling. Like, I thought he was going to go more in than that. And might be te te Italian as well. Hmm. So Christmas was not much for my end. Not much at all. I, I, yeah, I never really cared for Christmas as well. I mean, I recorded ahead of time, so I guess Christmas was just uh, a day off from YouTube. <laughs> and tear, set the creation, and just end it. I don't really need to use any of these young things right now. Okay. All right. I said, I have a good feeling that he probably has his uh, trap card set. Whenever I duel against DDs, whether it be real life or online, they always have a trap card, but I never get it. <laughs> this deck is good at coming back with the plays. I, said, I wouldn't be surprised if it's just... Uh, let's see if I know my DDs. What? Banish Slime, Summon... Uh, uh, what's his name? The guy with 22 mm. attack and 3,000 defense. So when he special summon, you summon one from the great record. Yeah, Ragnarok, Ragnarok. Yeah, Ragnarok. Yeah. Some Ragnarok summon back Alexander. Ragnarok is level 8, right? Yeah. Okay. Definitely one of the best cards in the deck. Mm-hmm. Why did I open no way into my gate? <laughs> I said, you plays... Didn't really blow me away. But I'm not the best DDD player. I'm probably the worst DDD player ever. <laughs> All you guys do on the video is just call me out on my play. It's like, you did this wrong. Like, of course. Yeah, it is definitely a car, car, quite a lot of skill. Yeah, it's probably... To use properly. There are so many plays you can do in the deck. Wow, setting. Wow. I really don't see that very often. Setting in uh, DVDs, it just doesn't seem like the kind of deck to set. Mm. What do I want to do? I think I might want to go on the offensive a little bit, though. Maybe, maybe summon Bixie and then let it get killed and summon Sawani and go in with Sawani. Nah, that's, that's a questionable play, too, just because I'm worried about him summoning his king. Are you a DVD or a DVD? You're just a DD. Yep. I don't want him to get his DDD 32 beater king chocolate fudge card guy. Of course. Like I said, it's just, it's just been fucked up. 
I do not know what the hell is going on with Google Plus today, but it's just been well. Why not? Why can't I run Yang Zings? What's wrong with playing Yang Zings? What's up, Carter? Austin Carter, I said your last name first. Like I said, I have plays. It's just, I don't feel like I want to do it right now. But I think I should start pushing before he starts getting into his DVD plays. Yeah, probably. Oh. Set, set. I want that one. Oh, well, I'm not the biggest fan of her either. I think it's pretty good. I think like, you can run it at one or something. I see some people running around one. But generally, don't you use her just to get the DD monster from your graveyard back to your hand? Wouldn't it be better to uh, run uh, the other pendulum monster that you could just pitch them to get it back to your hand? That way it doesn't cost uh, you. Lily, if it's a plus, that's yeah, the thing. Yeah, isn't he like a pendulum monster? I don't know of any. Yeah, yeah, Newton, I think, is a pendulum monster. It's a yeah, level Newton. 7 of zero attack. Remember Dark Dimension Sword of the End? What's Dark Dimension Sword of the End? That sounds like one of, one of Utah's cards, is it? Mm, not sure. On this live stream, I'm going to summon that, uh, that Star Venom Fusion Dragon. <laughs> Was... <laughs> it's like finally. We don't even know anything about it. No. <laughs> Only the name. I just level eight. Yeah. Okay. I have a quad core, eight gigs of RAM. So. I have twelve core and three gig 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 gigabytes of RAM. Well, oh, what worse than you? <laughs> And do you think Yang, Pendulum Yang Zing could be tier 1.5 or at least tier 2? Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, you also got to keep in mind when you, you describe tiers, it's also the ratio at which is played. I probably, I can't give it 1.5 just because the ratio when it's played isn't uh, high enough. I'd probably give it like... Yeah, because no one two. plays it through there. Yeah. In which I'm determining tier 2 because... Uh, I have to put it lower because the ratio isn't high, but can it do things against the you know the higher tier decks and possibly top? Yeah, so I I, I give it tier two. Apparently, one of the pendulum young sync players are currently number one on DN or something. Oh, that's nice. Mm-hmm. You said you're gonna have to go pretty in. I have a feeling that maybe. All right, summon that back, summon uh, uh, Howling back, make another Alexander, who is also level summon, maybe go for like a big guy or something, or Draco sack. Probably big guy and take my tear. I thought, yeah, that's wait, the hold, on, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I thought, I thought Nile Howling was when it's normal summoned. Yes, it is when it's normal summoned. Yeah, when it's, it's normal summoned. So that shouldn't be there. It was special summoned by Alexander. Ooh. Wow, six cores. You. My computer wow, is old. Seriously. My computer is at <laughs> least four or five years old. And which computer standard, that's old. Yeah, mine is also almost five years old. Yeah. After five years, you should probably get a new computer. Computers just rot really easily. Said, you're going to go into another Alexander, then have two sevens go into like a big guy and take my terror? That's the only thing I could think of that you could do to really handle tear. Because tear is, yep, because tear is one the living hell out of you right now. Yep. I'm gonna go ahead and put my mouse over it. Wow, I never mind. <laughs> okay. So you're just going to summon Flare because it can't be destroyed by card effects and I get burned for everything I do. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> sure. That definitely could be a problem for you because uh, you can't really stall anymore. Nope. You can just get burned every time a terror activates. Yep. 
Oh, I could just make a cast down and spin it. <laughs> I already have you bound the grave, so I really don't need Armageddon to do anything else. I'm not going to activate the effect. So, normal summon? No effect? Effect? Yeah. Still take the 500 now. Uh, no, I don't run any Exismos in my Young Sync deck because of creation restriction. Okay, activate and let target. Then you chain to burn. It doesn't and chain. It uh, activates when the effect resolves. Right, so I still get burned. Right? Because I go... It so has I'm... to be on the field to resolve, pretty much. Really? So You, you, won't, you won't get the 500 damage. Oh, really? I thought it, I thought it would go off after I uh, decap and select target for Castell. Then no, it activates after the effect has already resolved. Oh, okay. So, nice. <laughs> Alugua, um, I don't know what you put in the chat. Something about subscribe. I'm assuming something about subscribing to you because you have 300 subs. That's all I can get from that. Like, I, <laughs> hello. Yeah, he could have used Ragnarok's second effect and banished me, but he would still have to deal with Alter Nightmare. So, uh, I'm pretty good. Yeah. I'm just taking this duel extremely slow. I'm just worried about not being able to handle that dark contract. I probably should have activated my creations. Yeah, probably. I need, I need to start pushing now. Yeah, the Fusion Judge Dragon, maybe the next set. I said, depends on... How much yeah, after have? Shining Victory is pretty much. I think that's going to be the one. Because the set is called Dark Illusion. Yeah, of course. <laughs> and that's that we are going, probably going to get Dark Magician support as well, more than likely. Because yeah. we got the Blue Eyes supporting Shining Victories. So it's very li likely at that. Wow, trading? Run a lot of eights that I know of. Isn't he like the only level eight? Mm, well, there is uh, one more there. The 3000 guy, right? People don't really run him, though. Well, he's definitely not bad. Maybe the more pendulum based version of the deck? Yeah. to say you're not fucking taking me out like you did <laughs> like you did all of them security <laughs> all <those>. <laughs> well i'm definitely <laughs> looking forward to the um this week's uh, arc five episodes it's going to be pretty crazy mm -hmm. so how, how is he going to handle crow i mean obviously he's going to beat crow but how is he going to beat crow <laughs> like you cannot do you can't keep on doing the opening of freaking uh, you go versus fucking Yuya and not not have him beat Crow and go up to what? Would that be the finals, right? This is a semi it's a sem semifinals of Crow versus uh, Yuya, right? Yep. So he should be facing uh, Yugo in the finals. If the finals even takes place, so. <laughs> yeah, shit does seem like it's hitting the fan right now. All right. So he's going to go ahead and summon his DDD32 guy. Yeah. DDD, Wave Oblivion King Caesar Ragnarok. That's fine. You can't even use your effect because I have to have another monster on the field, right? Yep. That doesn't do anything. <laughs> yeah, that does nothing. So attack me all you want. Nothing's going to happen, though. Except the battling monster. 
God, this man's having a hard time against me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they don't don't have many outs to terror. New. <laughs> Got a tuner in the graveyard. Can make more use of Norton. Lord, Lord. He's, tra he's trying to give me the D, D, D <sighs> but I, I won't let him. He's not taking my virginity. Uh -uh. <laughs> I need to start doing some synchro plays. Damn, I just need to get a tuner. I wonder if he can pull off enough. I wonder how many uh, Wave Oblivion Kings he runs. Most only run one. It's not really that necessary. Not multiples. Hmm. All right, I think I'm going to be summoning Beyond, then activating my double creation. I mean, creation, both creations go off and the Beyond, summoning what I need to uh, make a synchro play. And then I keep on forgetting that these guys can synchro summon during my opponent's turn, right? The non tuners? Yep. Or my opponent's main phase or battle phase. So, yeah, I'll go ahead and do that. Okay. You gonna activate your trap card? He's like, wow. Alright, so all the effects. I was taking it slow, but now I can't. I can't risk taking it slow anymore. So Let's see. Yeah, now I can. So I'll go ahead and summon you. I'll summon you, and I'll summon you. I thought the guy who kept coming your took your virginity. Oh yeah. Oh, that was so annoying. Like that was the most annoying shit ever. Yeah, that was pretty much the only out. Uh... <laughs> to fucking the Megazord. <laughs> you just sacked the living shit out of me. Well, thankfully, uh, that uh, can't be used against Ultimate Falcon because it's Wing Priest, not Machine. <laughs> oh my god, fucking Ultimate Falcon. That's all I've been seeing people do lately is spam Ultimate Falcon and spam the, the fucking Leopard uh, Moonlight bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I said ban towers and then make like fucking three other monsters and <laughs> do what towers does. Like, yeah. <laughs> well, they down. are harder to summon than towers, at least. You no, know, the Red Raptor guy is pretty easy. You just use fucking. Yeah, if you like uh, throw a very specific combo, your last tricks and your skip force. I said, I'm going to sink our segment when I see a threat. But I seriously doubt you can pull off a threat right now. Like I said, it depends on how many uh, Wave Kings you run. That's fine. I said, give me a threat and I'll respond. Because I can play it. I can do it during my battle phase or my or your main phase. So, Yep. Yep. King, Oracle. Oh, no. All right. Sure. Target okay, one DGD monster in your graveyard, so summon it. You know. Okay, so that's what he's planning on doing. He's planning on summoning back his uh, Ragnarok through the effect of yep. uh, Flame King. All right. That's fine. I said, I'll allow you to keep doing your plays, and then I'll fuck you up later. Yep. Sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah, next year is going to be so crazy in Yu-Gi-Oh! Because of the 
Braves of Shadow and all that. Mm-hmm. I don't know if you York can survive that, quite honestly. <laughs> Hopefully, Konami does something with the new balance, but I really doubt that. <laughs> Sometime in like March. So I kind of don't want you to have this, this, or this. <laughs> but I don't want yep. this back in the extra deck. Oh, uh, do I? No, I do. I do. Yeah, I do. No, it's Breaker and Meta. Uh, yep. The live stuff is coming out in what? Shining Victory? Uh, what's coming out? The, the blue eye stuff. Yep. He's like, hmm. <laughs> so you 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 gotta handle my backseat. I'm not sure if you can, but you got to. Because next turn I can destroy Terror and then summon Yang Zing, because they're both win. And uh, Baxia doesn't make my shit miss timing, right? Yeah, because Yang Zing monsters are win. So, Baxia doesn't make Terra miss timing, it would make the uh, Yang Zing monsters miss timing. So I'm definitely going to come at you with the Ultimate Nightmare next turn. Oh, damn, he's just like Melp Scoop. Damn. Oh, no. That duel took way longer than it should have. It really did. Actually, it's, it's kind of upsetting. <laughs> At least more people are here. All right, does anybody want to do me? Well, look at the top. Only E and me and post Porsche, lol. Who the wants to do wants to with that? <laughs> Shining Victories is after the Monarch stuff. Monarch stuff is in January, right? End of January? Yep, in the structure deck. Yep. And when does Breaker meta come out? Also end of January? Yeah, 15th of January. Okay, so mid-January, yeah. I think the man list is going to be like in March. I think they're gonna allow shit to go crazy for like one month, <laughs> one like a half a month, and then they're gonna be like, "All right, no, never mind, <laughs> this is stupid." Yeah, definitely. At least uh, OCG hit the tier tier zero deck, but they didn't hit any of the other decks for some reason. Uh, against walls and forty. But I don't. I don't even want to try dueling against Blue Eyes with that fucking DD deck. That can easily drop a three thousand beater, and all I have is my freaking uh, Wave King to really get over. Struggles real. And they pump out Blue Eyes so easily. Yeah, uh, definitely. Yeah, a rant, a rant. The Blue Eyes deck definitely you now has some potential. Mm -hmm. Just, just bam, Blue Eyes. That fucking gospel, God. <laughs> But we still don't have any good way to summon out the uh, blue eyes ultimate dragon. I don't think I've seen anybody summon blue eyes ultimate dragon. <laughs> like not once. <laughs> yeah, the only good way is dragon's mirror, but you don't want to punish your blue eyes monsters. I have a feeling that my opponent here is using something sacky. Trag. Um, you um, have to. Hello? <laughs> hello? Um, hello? What the fuck is that? <laughs> Shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. And here, people, this is a noob. <laughs> It's, it, wow. 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 Fucking wow. Wow. <laughs> Wait, guys, that's the problem with the end that uh, some cards are really hard to do on the end, so I guess that's why some screw up uh, some.
We cost had, like both of the handle. Really top off. Just excavate. <laughs> it clearly says excavate. I, maybe he was just too much of a noob to know what the word excavate means. Okay. Okay, it's fine. Sure. This is my last time playing this deck. This deck just turns out to be ass and I'm done. <laughs> yeah, I don't think uh, Moonox really fit well together with you well. Doesn't they are like much. completely different uh, decks. One sec. I'm, gonna I'm just going to delete this deck. If you guys want it, then you guys can go ahead and uh, make it yourself. But I'm, I'm going to be done. <laughs> oh, it's my Jason's. Mm hmm. That sucks. I was thinking about maybe banishing his scales, but now I can't. Oh, and you're just going to take it slow? Get set up for next turn? Oh, it's Dragon Pit. You actually got a pendulum summon? One. All right. Apex Avion? No. Oh. Okay. Mm, I just wants to use that Fiaspa's effect. Mm-hmm. I could easily just win this duel by just going fucking... Oh, no, because he has uh, his Dragon Pit. And he'll obviously get. I'll try and beat Tony to store his present traps. Oh right, right. Yeah, I could easily just. No, I don't want to destroy his monsters, but many don't run that card. So, are you gonna get that magician? You yeah, have that, that. I don't know what this card is. Hmm. Oh, never mind. I got fucking tenacity. Wow. All right. Well, that's probably it's game. Game over. Oh. Yeah, that's game. Yep, that's game. He's gonna have to have a lot of fucking magicians in his hand to pull off this play. We'll go ahead and get March. Then we'll just summon. Uh, what's his name? And then he'll give me an additional normal summon. A tribute summon monster. Yeah, after you might be to an additional normal summon. Yep. <laughs> What's your baby artifact? You can just banish it to summon a muscle out from the graveyard pretty much. Oh, okay. Like, damn. I said, I wonder if he actually, because he has to use him to pop this and then have the other one to pop this as well. So he has to have, so that yep. means he has to have two magicians to pitch. Or is it just pendulum monsters? I think it's just pendulum monsters, right? Yeah, he two pendulum, pendulum monsters. monsters. And he has to be running the 1800 one that not a lot of people run, if one. Yeah, I run one of it because it's pretty good. And because I run Trump Girl as well, and it's the only scale one in the deck. Oh my god, he's gonna search for Scout. <laughs> was, I don't think someone's heart three in the setting in the deck. You only, ha only have one target for it, like why? I'd say Dragon Pit's not that important. You have Skull Crowbat, Joker, and and just so many other cards and that you don't really need to run Summoner's Art to get that. Mm-hmm. Destroy and put her. Mm-hmm. I don't think that TCG is going to go after Wisdom Eye like they did in the OCG. Yeah, who knows? Oh, yeah. Yeah. This tech is going to fall out of favor after the... after, yeah... Pendulum Sorcerer comes out. There's going to be only one deck that is 
That's inconvenient. He did have the exact play I was hoping he wouldn't. Yeah, that's what's yeah, going on. Yeah, now you ask that pretty much. Yep. Especially since I can't target his pendulum scout. Like, I can Kaius, but what the fuck is that going to do? Something yeah, not much. I pretty much have to top deck an MST, MST the Sky Iris, and then banish his scales. And then be able to handle the monsters that he's going to pendulum summon. Like, I, I think I'm pretty screwed. screwed. I said, I, I think that the ban list is going to be pretty quick. They can't uh, they can't have notice running around like that. I don't know. LCG is crazy, though. Yeah, well, she just didn't hit that card at all. Yeah, I hit that card. But at the same time, they also have so much judgment legal, so... I was hoping that he wasn't going to get the Wisdom Mine and do all of them plays. Hoping that he wouldn't have the plays, but he did. <laughs> it's just going to crush me with this tier 1.5 deck. Now, currently, it is one of the tier 1 decks for sure. Is it a tier 1 deck? Yeah, I think so. Like, uh, right now, there isn't really That's anything else about this. Because isn't it more of a tier 1 deck when combined with uh, four mages? Mm, yes, that is more popular variant, but Autos Magicians is also uh, really good and is topping all, quite a lot. Almost as much as the performance variant. All right, yeah, let's game. <laughs> well, there was good like not a graveyard at all. <laughs> Yeah, let's go. <laughs> there is no way I can handle Vortex Dragon, his Tendrum Scales, his Negates. Like, no, that's it. Yeah, that's game over. Mm -hmm. Just uh, too good of the deck. Mm -hmm. I said, I'll try this. As soon as he goes Negate, I'll be like, all right, you got it. <laughs> Go ahead and tell me negate. Yeah, of course, like that was pretty much given. Yep. So can I use? Because she'll go in the graveyard. Can I use him to banish to summon her back and use her effect again, or can she only be activated once per turn? Yeah, it's definitely once per turn. I don't think they have would have. This card is normal summon special summon. You can special summon. You cannot special summon from actually turn into this card. This card is into gray, right? Blah, 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 blah. You can only use each effect. I didn't. Did I use it? Yeah, I used it, didn't I? Yep. Yep. It still counts pretty much. Yep. So even if you negate me, you still got it. No. <laughs> no. It was just. No. Yeah, blow off. You just had the answers to everything. I even tried to lock you out, and you're like, nah, I still got this. Does yeah, Dian have a crystal wing yet? Uh, I haven't checked. I haven't checked today. I should probably check. Yeah, probably not, because Dian only um, puts new cards when the set is actually released. Yeah, so probably not. Yeah, which kind of sucks. Oh, <laughs> I hope not pretty busted. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't seem too bad. Mm -hmm. Yep, I opened up. Ah, uh, fantastic. <laughs> oh, I opened up the tits. <laughs> I can destroy my opponent right now. Wow. Wow. All right, people. Time to go off. Two of those Mystic Tomates even work out for you. Sometimes. It depends on how I open. They're slow, but they're decent. Because they can summon both Mally and Labradite, so. 
Andy Bell. So yeah, that's true. I said there's, there's, there's I can't say that there's anything better to run unless you have any suggestions. No, I don't think so. I. Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, I opened up so good. <laughs> I opened up like the perfect can. Yeah, it's Ultima and Mm-hmm. Can't hate on two Ultimaeus. Exactly who I want to summon too. I guess spells and something else. Yeah, that works as well, I guess. <laughs> no regeki and no targety. <laughs> So you can have that anyone I'm mad at. I'm worried about that Regeki. Because Regeki will fuck me right now. Yep. Oh, I think it's the reason it does. I have the steer on that insect card. Wow. Alright, just gonna run just straight. Blah, 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 blah. Alright. Mm hmm. Yeah, still have to deal, deal with that Starless first. Mm -hmm. Now that was pretty good throw. Yep. All right, I'll go for Bills. Crash. Wow, that's annoying. Wow, yeah, because your wow, that's is now game. locked. Yeah, that's, that's game. Wow, so he got everything to beat me. I opened up the chip <laughs> and he still gets everything. What the fuck? Oh my god, that's so annoying. Of course it was Fiendish Chain. Anything else and I've been fine. Oh my it's god, that's so game. fucking annoying. So he'll just attack over my fucking stars and then wipe me. Yeah, pretty much, unfortunately. Wow. Wow. Can't too much wow. 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 Wow, that's so annoying. <laughs> wow. Well, happens. I hate Yu Gi Oh! It's so annoying. Like, there's nothing good about Yu Gi Oh! Wow. Yeah, sometimes it is annoying. Like, But really, it was always that way. Right? Yeah. No, no. Yeah, like, wow. So he's like, yeah, I got the thing to change just for what you're exactly what you're gonna do. I'm like, god damn. I was like, well, at least I have to do the Stardust. Now I can just run over my Stardust and fucking just go for game. Like, that's it. I can't even fucking resummon or do anything. Like, that's it. I said, you got it. Wow. Oh, next card. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. You got it. Maybe you should have only summoned one Ultimaya. And not, not overextended like that. No, Ultimaya is good when you stack it. It's just he had anything. No, no, you got it. I have nothing. <laughs> I think no. it's supposed to play it out, but no. <laughs> no, you got it. He was, yeah, he was too skilled. <laughs> like, and now he's all upset. Like, what, you, oh, what? You got it. You got it. Run over my starters and wipe me main phase two. Like, that's it. You got it. And I was just going to draw him the ultimate nightmare anyway, so I would have had nothing. What? I was going to fucking summon back Labradite with fucking, uh, with Silent Doom? Ooh. No. I can't do anything! <laughs> oh, like, nigga. Oh my god, I hate people like that. They win, and then they're salty that they won. Like, I can't do shit. You have it. The duel would have been much more fun yeah. if you didn't have that fiendish shame. I would have probably gave you a much better duel, but you had everything. You had the answers. You outskilled me. Quote, unquote. Yeah, there have been some people on Tepro who, uh, who won against me. I, I surrendered at the end day. I start insulting me for no reason. <laughs> I hate BN. I hate Yu-Gi-Oh, actually. Scratch that. I hate Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> well, I mostly just hate the top decks and the, uh, most of the community. No, I hate, no, no. I hate Yu-Gi-Oh. 
I hate everything about Yu-Gi-Oh. If I didn't have my YouTube channel, I would have quit Yu-Gi-Oh a long time ago. You don't even not like Yu-Gi-Oh anime. <laughs> no. It's too luck-based. Yu-Gi-Oh anime is luck-based. <laughs> of, of course! <laughs> no, 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 that, that, that's magic. That's magic. Yeah, that's I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Like, of course, I draw and choose the perfect card to win the duel. Your fucking scripted ass duels. <laughs> That's too luck based. I was thinking about maybe going into Void Ogre and then trying to crash because could, I couldn't even get in the background, but I thought it Stardust would have covered anything that I would have ran into, but oh. Ugh, this hand's not good. If I had another sender, it would have been great, but nope. Well, then I don't think you like card games in general because they are all pretty much luck based. Some even more than Yu Gi Oh! itself. Yep. No, I'm just gonna take it slow. I can take it a turn slow. I don't play any other card games besides Yu Gi Oh! So. <laughs> yeah, same here. <laughs> if there was a Digimon card game that, yeah. Was actually viable, then I would play that, but otherwise, yeah, no. Yeah, no one plays, no one plays Digimon. <laughs> See, and we're going against fucking uh, Yingzing, so this should be fun. I don't think I'm gonna like this duel. I think this build is going to be really difficult. I think he's going to float it up. Yeah, possibly. So I'm not sure if I like Ying Zings or dislike Ying Zings. Okay, I think I'm kind of neutral when it comes no, to I think they're okay. They are not, at least they are not overpowered. Yeah. When they were first revealed, they, I thought they were really annoying, but... The other decks were a lot worse, like Shuttles and, and Shuttle Knights as well. Yeah. It's like BA, Shuttle, <laughs> like all them decks. At least Young Sins can miss timing. There's one Ultimaya. Uh, Debate on what the fuck I want to do against him. I wonder if those are actually two creations set. Might be. I could go scrap Beals again. Scrap Beals and, and pop one. Or should I just go scrap? Scrap. Scrap Clearwing. Scrap Stardust. I think it may be Scrap Stardust, just in case he has Regeki. Yeah. All right. Instead, just pull off the plays, but if my opponent has the ticks, then I lose. <laughs> yeah, but you are making very overextending plays, but that, that, if your board gets wiped, you are pretty much screwed. Yep, that's why I go for Stardust. Because th these guys can't be uh, targeted by attacks or by uh, card effects while I, st while I have each other, so it's kind of like a little soft lock. It's the only thing you can do. Yeah, but like <laughs> If you can mass wipe me, then I'm fucked. So, some scrap, some scrap. Because I want to go after his set cards. I don't want any creations because I know it seems like it's either revival or creation because he would have stopped me by now. Yeah, see? It's cool of content. Now the question is should I go after him or leave it alone? Uh, if I feel like if I go after him, I feel like I feel like he's going to go ahead and summon uh, uh, Gia and Gia. Yeah, Gia to and then go off pretty much. So the biggest threat I have right now is maybe summon Gia and then go into Goyo and run one over my monsters over, run my Stardust over, I guess. 
and then throw the regek at me, and then I'll fucking kill myself right here on the stream. <laughs> oh, <that was> so... <laughs> yeah, I can't do that. <laughs> Fun. At least you didn't do what I thought you were gonna do. That's all that matters. What the fuck? <laughs> Why? <laughs> all the fucking time. I thought you think about maybe doing Void Ogre too. Uh, I guess Beals. Or. <sighs> Bellsa is not really that good against young not things because they can just bounce it. Yeah. Very easily. I guess clearing then. Yeah. That's probably the best idea. I'm wondering what scrap should destroy. I don't need a race. I'll probably just destroy this the swing that I set. I don't really need it. There it was. <laughs> I still hate going after the fucking Yangzing monsters. They float so hard, it fucking sucks. Yeah, it's mostly, it's always better to just leave them alone and wait it out once uh, they have to do something. And then you counter the place and then that's that. But I can't. I have nothing to do against them. Yeah, can't, that's I true, I guess. I can't wait it out, not with this deck, unless I had some back row or something. I'm running back around this deck, so I really can't wait it out. Oh. And of course they have that. <laughs> mm -hmm. I haven't even dealt it. I haven't touched it since I last made it. Yeah, I'm not sure if I would even main deck Twin Twister. Like, uh... Alright, I know he has one creation, but I know he was going to have two. Yeah. This is probably the last duel stream. I gotta get ready to go. Yeah. I'm going to do my own live stream on next week on Wednesday. Alright, I can of course, you are invited if you want to come. If I'm not busy. I shouldn't be. Alright, obviously he's gonna go into Yazi. That's a given. Yeah, more than likely. That's not going to do much for. I'd rather have it dead and you get your search because I can go ahead and handle your spells and traps. He said, I still don't know how I feel about Yang Zings. Young things can be really boring. They Sometimes are. It's so slow. Well. When do you think I should keep it there? Yeah, twelve takes so much time. Uh, yeah, because they float. They didn't float and it'd be easy duel. Hmm. <laughs> so we've got completely <laughs> useless tech for much. <laughs> do that you want to leave it there? Uh, just leave it there. Go ahead. I think this matchup is terrible. Yeah, possibly. If I had fucking crystal meth right now, crystal meth. Yeah, that's what be really good. I wish I had some crystal meth. Yeah, I have crystal wing in so many attacks currently. <laughs> He's like, you know, you know, we got to know that I call it crystal magic. <laughs> yeah, I do. I haven't noticed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, what the hell? <laughs> um, how did this get summoned? Uh, no idea. 
It's only once per turn. Once per turn. Yeah, it's only once per turn. Once per turn. And cheater. <laughs> Says the, it's the first fucking three words of the card. You already activated this turn. The card was really broken if it wasn't once per turn. Huh? Cards are already really good. <laughs> this duel is so long. Why did I have to do against fucking Yang Lings? Anything yeah, like that. Yeah, it has been like so long since the deck has re was released. Like, oh my god, Mingzing duels just take a millennium. Yeah, I know. <laughs> really long time. They can just mm. keep defending until there are not monsters. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then it just paths it up. I totally thought giving them a path and shit like that would be good. I wish I had Crystal Mass. If I had Crystal Mass right now, we'd be so fine. Yeah, I'd be snorted it up and this duel would be over. But yeah, unfortunately, the end doesn't have that. They don't update that fast. Yep. So I can go ahead and have Scrap destroy the creation, but I still can't do anything. I really don't want to end this duel, but I'm, I literally have to get ready to go. I don't have time to deal with his floatiness. And it wouldn't be the first time that I literally just scooped the Young Zings because I don't have time to deal with their floatiness. Yeah, I don't have time. Yeah, that sucks. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, you got it. I don't, I don't, I don't. I don't have time. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not going to spend the next fucking 20, 30 minutes dueling you. I really don't have time. I gotta go. If anything, if it was anything but fucking Yang Zings. Even, even, even fucking, uh, uh, ah, uh, fuck. Uh, what deck do I want to say? Fucking Ghost Tricks. Let me see, let me see if I have Crystal. Yeah, at least Ghost Tricks don't have infinite resources. So I could probably take out the tomatoes and put in my Twin Twister or something for some back row hate. Yeah, possibly. I don't know. We'll deal with that later. <sighs> like I said, I think the ban list will probably be sometime in March, so I'll probably do my ban list prediction maybe like February 1st. Yeah. Yeah. So, anyway. I mean, as you can see, it's not like I'm not working on it. <laughs> I'm actually writing things Miles. down. <laughs> I, I named it February because I thought maybe February, but then I was like, nah, March. March February's too early. Yeah, probably. So, anyway, I'm done with the live stream. I apologize, they're short. Uh, so, are you planning on coming back next week so I can go ahead and... Yeah, I think so. I will definitely come back if you want. Okay. So Omega will be back next weekend. We'll have our usual two hours. Apologize, I have to go. Really busy. Uh, so, uh, I hope that you guys can do it despite that. Uh, do you guys have any suggested decks? You can go ahead and tell me, and I can work on them So uh, while I'm not streaming, so we don't have to spend the nice majority of the stream working on decks. And, uh, yeah, that's it. I don't know. It's, it's just me. I kind of feel like the streams weekly are getting kind of stale. Maybe we could maybe make them, like, every other week just because I'm already running out of things to do. <laughs> I'm already oh, running out of things. Already, love. Already, already. Like, I mean, you don't every... have enough UL decks. I really don't. I don't have enough UL decks, people. So, I don't know. You guys tell me. So, I don't know. I might put a separate video about it because... Not everybody watches the streams, and this question is like literally at, at the end of a stream. So I'll probably put a separate video about it. But yep. I don't know. I'm already running out of ideas, running out of decks, and running out of things we can do. Like, so it's supposed to make up for the missing Y and Y, but even that, we're not really doing much. Anyway, thank you, Omega, for joining me. No problem. Glad to join you for as always. Right, and we'll be back next weekend. Uh, we're not going to put up the change yet if, it, if we do decide to do it every other week, but. Uh, we'll definitely come back next weekend. Uh, the day was it? Isn't it the second? The day after New Year's, I want to say. Um, yeah, it's the second. Yeah, pretty much. All right. So I'll see you guys in uh, 2016 for our first live stream of the year. Uh, so, like I said, if you have any suggestions, go ahead and tell me. And uh, yeah, see you next Saturday. Thanks for watching.